Howdy folks, Dirt Maps Dad here. Today I will be taking Kamazots here into an assault match along with Dirt Nap Dan as Neath, our friend Arab Cowboy as Soul, and uh, Dicey Victory here as Zing Qian, and our one random as Thanatos going up against an Ares, Hu Yi, uh, Emma Terasu, an Apollo, and a Geb. Uh, so I debated here, you know, playing the Assassin on Assault can definitely be one of the harder, uh, classes to play here, but Kamazots, well, he's got some sustain to him with his, with his passive, and, you know, he's not too bad on this map, because you can kind of get in, take a couple hits, get out, and then go drink up the, the mess. <laughs> uh, so I was looking around at some different build items here. Uh, form. I wasn't quite sure where I wanted to go, you know, looking at the starter items, I think, you know, I think I am going to go bluestone here, go for that, that little extra damage on some of the poke attacks that I'm going to get here. And that's the other nice thing about Kamazot's for Assault, you know, his square and his X uh, are both, you know, projectile type attacks that go out and away from him, aren't close range, so you can get some poke in with that. He's got his, his, his leap, while it's not a tremendous leap, still is a leap. Uh, so he has a, a good in and out uh, as well here. <clears throat> and, you know, his, his alt is also another uh, good move, you know, for getting in and out. So again, he, he works pretty well for assault despite being an assassin. Boy, all right, right away, I can't even get out to dodge here and, and things are going on. But let's go ahead and drop some, some items there. And Gavin, just look at his health drop. Gosh, I almost feel like the crocodile hunter here. I almost went into that full full boat impersonation there. <laughs> uh, but anyway, you know, I was feeling pretty good about that initial uh, hitting him with both the square and the X uh, or one and two along with the blue stone. And look at him sitting back there. You know, I mean, that, that health went down pretty far when everything was all said and done. Com you know, it was a little bit of a combination of what my team did and you know, what I did. It wasn't just all me there, uh, obviously. So, all right, so we get minions pushed up here real quick. Uh, so we've got good clear going on with the team here, trying to time some shots in here with some poke. We get we get Apollo hit there, and, oh, Ares, sorry, buddy. Uh, Oni got Neath, and she's going to get right the heck out of Dodge. I go in looking for some poke. Can't quite reach them, though. Oh, you know, I know it's early. I'm trying to be patient. And you know I struggle with that, you know. Got to be patient. Oh, we get a, get another hit on Geb there. So, again, we just continue to poke on these guys and keep those health totals low. Give us some opportunity. Oh, fell just short on that. And I kind of thought he was going to drift up there and I might be able to grab him with it. But no go here. And I'm just looking at the alt. But with Kamazot's alt, my old brain and these old hands... It's one I've struggled with a little bit, so, you know, I, I wanted to, to use it to effectiveness, but, you know, it's hard for me to kind of see and do everything and, ah, uh, you know, all that fun stuff. But here we go up, and there's one hit, there's two hits, and bam, there it is! We take down Amaterasu for our first kill of the game. And, look, I got these nice little puddles up here that I can kind of just, like, oh, all right, I'm going to kind of... Play the help keep that guy at bay. Let those guys attack the tower while I heal up. And All right. Well, you know, the minions are in my way. But I'll still take the health from that. You know, make sure I'm topped off well there. <clears throat> all right. So we got some really good poke on the tower there. Oh, get another shot in there on... Uh, was that Hu Yi we caught there? And, oh, down goes the tower. All right. So get some great early pressure here. Let's go ahead and eat up the the Geb roll for my team, because I got the health to, to, to take that and get back, and, uh, you know, I wanted the beads that, I missed the beads, and turns out I didn't really need the beads at all, so, was able to save them there, and high five, you know, all right, Dicey taking down Amaterasu again, boy, look at all those low house, boy, this team just does not have anything, and, oh, Apollo coming in from behind, where's he going, where's he going, this way, that way, Nope, I got him right. I got him right. No, oh, I got I up in the minions, but yes, I do. Turn around and attack the right proper direction and drop Apollo. Now I'm 2-0 and 3 and feeling pretty good. Going for a drink there. I'm going for a drink over here. Yeah, I could press up with my team and help here, but you know what? 
uh, in my mind, being full strength and health and then going up, much better. Much better. Then I can really get it in hell. You know, even if it's tanking the tower shots for a little bit from the edge here, you know, get in. Oh, I really thought I was going to have Geb with that, but that was a nice juke back on his part. Get the bats in on Ares, and again, just get my pokes and back on out. Oh, I see Geb coming in, getting out of position. Let's get the jump in on him, get some basic attacks in here, and get the abilities going. Look at him melt. There goes one. Let's get the all in. Can we get some hits in with that? Looks like we did. I'm not even quite sure. I should look for the numbers here during the replay, but I'm just kind of trying to watch my actual progression and, and so forth here. So again, so I can get better at what I'm doing. You know, it's, it's the whole reason why I do not just the videos, but why I started recording all my games to begin with. Uh, you know, I loved watching YouTube videos of other players and, oh, I felt bad missing that one. Uh, but it was helping me improve my game. And so I, you know, but ran out of videos for the people that I liked and enjoyed watching, so started recording my own videos and started watching them back too, and you know, and then I'm like, well, why am I doing this and putting it up online, and well, that's why you get what you have here today now is, uh, you know, I, I carried through with that, but let's get up in one here on Aries and, and, and really just try to press in here with some Zing Chien, I'm like, oh no, I need to get out, I need to get out, 71 health, well, yeah, Arab Cowboy comes in and cleans up my mess for me. I preach and oh Apollo with the all oh, and the revenge. Well, it is assault. That's going to happen, especially when you have guys like uh, you know Thanatos or Apollo that can do stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, you know they'll, they'll be able to jump over the group and and, and pick somebody off in the back. So I don't feel bad about that. You know that I didn't see him coming in and and manage to dodge. Even if I would have, I was so low in health that. It, was more than likely going to be the enemy anyway. Uh, but, you know, hey, I get back. So what do we buy here? We, uh, you know, we got uh, Beat Stick. And, uh, you know, I decided to pick up some physical defenses here. Uh, going with the Breastplate of Valor. A, because I'm going to be in here mixing up Melee-wise, which is going to draw some minion attention or tower attention. I wanted the cooldowns. I'm looking to be a team player here. I'm not just trying to get all the kills and, and all that fun stuff. You know, I just want to... I'm looking to win the game here. And and I know a little bit of defense here will go a long way. Because I am taking minion poke. Uh, getting out here on these guys. Throwing these little jabs out. You know, with my abilities. So, hey, you know. Got to do what you got to do sometimes. Maybe I could have went more lifesteal. But I just really didn't feel like... That was the right way because you know more often than not you will see anti heals from the other team because it is assault and there's a lot of healing going on in it even if you don't have healers you have you know a lot of meditations going on not my best of uh not my best of alts there and didn't even get in to, to finish that kill off there but hey we still have a good run we got them pushed up under tower and uh like I was just saying, this isn't about me playing this game. This is about my team and us having a successful run at this match as a unit. Oh, let's jump ahead in front there. You know, again, I was happy I had the armor there because I'm jumping towards danger to get away from danger. And, uh, you know, again, it's a good thing to have. So, all right, we get the get the bats in on Ares, get our echo in on Ares. We also dodge the chain from Ares. Take a little bit of tower poke from it, but again, we prepared for that, so it's okay. Let's go ahead and, and beads the a little slow, but I beads out of the stun, which still allowed me to get out of dodge and avoid the, the worst of that. <clears throat> Stand in our puddle back here, get get some uh, some life and mana back, and we got plenty of puddles up here on the front side too. <clears throat> so again, we're just putting that constant pressure on here with them. Uh, and, and this was just a match where, you know, it, we had a really, really long queue uh, for Dicey. Dan and I, we were doing some rank joust and an Arab popped in and we were already well past our double amount of normal waiting time in, in, in the queue. So we were all a little frustrated. So it's like, yeah, let's go ahead and just add you, add you in here to the group, Arab. Go ahead, pop in an assault and just kind of pop off on some people here. And as you can see at 19 and 5... Yeah, we're doing just that. You know, I've I feel like uh, you know while I didn't go for the, the get all the kills uh, guy here, I did get a lot of damage out. Uh, you know, through the poke, 
while staying relatively safe, sitting at 2, 1, and 10. Yeah, I'll take a, a nice group of assists here. <clears throat> get in, get some of the minions out of the way. And again, look at all those low health bars on the enemy side. You know, we're starting to get some here on our side too, but again, we're also pressing into their phoenix, so we're expecting that a little bit. Let's go ahead and go behind who ye's all. Yeah, let's go. Can we pick him up with the all, with our all? No, he gets down by dirt nap. Damn, but we did get a hit in there, I think, on him. And there's another one as Amateris who falls down, and that's going to be Phoenix with it there as well. And boy, look at that puddle. I, I'm like, I think I got like a total of four of them there, all pulled together. That was brilliant. All right, so let's go ahead and get some poke here on the Titan. Oh, Ares did pick me up with the chain. Speed's down, and I'm not going to be able to get out of that. And that is, unfortunately, going to be the end of that life. We were a little aggressive there. We, in hindsight, would have been much better to drop the Phoenix, get any kills we could have, and then drop back and waited for fire minions to press in uh, there. Uh, so let's go back here. Oh, that's right. We weren't going Breastplate. We went, ended up going Nemean here just because... They did have an Apollo, a Huyi, and Amaterasu uh, that were all putting a lot of upfront damage out. Uh, and I believe Apollo and Huyi both started off with a uh, big crit item. One of them. I'm not sure which one it was. The arts got me a little confuddled, confusled, combobulated. I don't know. That's exactly right. I just don't know what the names of them are anymore uh, just by looking at all the pictures. But I knew that they had big crit items, so that's why I threw in that extra uh, the Nemi in there for that. As we pick up Apollo coming back out, let's go ahead and get some alt in here. Can we get on that Geb and take him down? Oh, come on. Where is it at? Where is it at? Just not enough. Is it as he rolls away and just gets back to Phoenix? Okay, not enough tick damage there to, to finish him off but we're gonna go ahead and fall back because yeah that got me in a bit of trouble and i am gonna go down again well i had the blinders on folks and well it was a close one i almost had the geb and and would have been worth the trade in my mind but alas dirt nap's dad did it again got the blinders on got out of position left myself rather vulnerable to the aries uh but again, you know, hey, it is assault. Sometimes that will happen. We're still sitting at 3-3 three and three with 14 assists and a 30-12 to 12 overall uh, kill ratio here. I mean, almost 10,000 uh, difference in gold. Uh, this time I decided I'm probably, mm, excuse me, probably going to go for Jotun's. But maybe, maybe, just maybe the Crusher too. And, oh, looks like... Um, Zing Chen and I are not going to get back there in time as the attack the Titan calls are coming out. But can we? There goes Apollo. But they're getting pushed out of the Titan area. But I think we can get in here and do this. I think I actually do have time to catch up now. All right. No, no. <sighs> they, uh, they surrendered. Well... We kind of knew that was coming. That was a real good game. I, I have not played a lot of Kamazots uh, at all. Uh, just a game here or there with them. Uh, and I played, you know, an assault with them, you know, maybe a month or so ago and a month before that, maybe, or so forth. Uh, let's go out here and see. So uh, overall here, worshiper-wise, you can see, yeah, that's 68 total worshippers there. Uh, as we finish 3, 3, and 14, Soul and Arab Cowboy with the 13 and 2. Nice hard carry there. There's your stats uh, and everything uh, for the game. Again, I felt pretty good at the 8,500. Uh, you know, looking over at the enemy team, that was better than their Hu Yi uh, and their Amaterasu and Geb. Uh, I would not have expected it to be better than the Hu Yi. Uh, so I'm guessing, unfortunately, he didn't know how to play that guy too well. And I can't say much because I've never played Hu Yi, although he's definitely on my radar right now. I've been reading up about him a little bit more and I'm definitely intrigued, and especially after watching him in some of the SPL uh, events recently. That was, uh, you know, yeah, I think I'm going to try him soon. So keep an eye out for some videos coming out for me and Hu Yi. Uh, 
other you know the normal roundup here so hey make sure you've hit that subscribe button i mean if you watch this far in why not you can watch another one here coming up soon you know hit the the notification bell so you know when when stuff's popping here you know make sure you give the video a like give me some comment loves let me know how you would build camazots here in assault uh what you may have done differently and so forth i'm all about you know getting that uh feedback here and actually while i'm thinking of it just wanted to pop back here what I, oh that was uh da, 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 that's the new is it deathbringer yeah, so they, they both started off heavy crit right off the bat. That's why I went high to the Nemean, just because, well, I'd already pissed off Apollo, too. So, you know, he had his eyes on me. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, you know, all right. I'm feeling pretty good. But, hey, um, last night, uh, oh, yes, other things. Make sure you stop by my streams Wednesday nights, uh, 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Times. You can catch me and Dirtnap Dan and our friends. We've been doing a lot of ranked uh, joust play during that time. I've, you know, got my qualifiers in. I started off in the basement in Bronze 5. I've already worked up to Bronze 4, and I'm about two-thirds of the way through that already, getting ready to uh, jump up into Bronze 3, uh, which is, you know, my next goal here, to just keep on climbing that ladder. Uh, you know, hey, let's have some fun. Let's create a great community here. Work together. Help each other out. You know, leave those comments down below. And hey, my tip for you when it comes to dirt naps, you got to give them before you take them. Peace out, folks.